and then we're gonna take a crap. We're not actually gonna crap in the toilet because I think it's seen enough of that. Oh yeah, we're gonna stick our head down it instead. That's right, we're gonna get right in nice and close. And we're gonna make grunting noises. Lovely. The fuck, it just flashed under me. A golden gun! Did I just shit out a gold gun? What the f- What? I just shot out a golden gun. And I don't know where I am. So I died. Uh, I'm now in the middle of the map. I'm again right by water. No, that's good. Did I lose my tin opener? That's what I'm worried about. That bastard took my tin opener. I'm really upset by this. Let's find another tin opener. Right, okay, we're gonna try and play it safe. We're not gonna get into any boxing matches against zombies because apparently they're better than us. Where the hell am I? This, uh, some, there's some kind of trench here, which I imagine was probably built by all the Nazis that came over in Operation Paperclip. Yeah, that's right. I know a thing or two. JK, just kidding. Um, right, we're heading towards the water, and there's like one little red dot here, so we'll see if there's a house here with a tin opener, because I'm not letting Charlie keep my tin opener, unless I get another one. How far away? I, that's spotting me quite a way away from where I was. So basically, the moral of this story, and the lesson is, guys, don't box the zombies. Their heads are made of steel. Okay. This is what's well, a big lake, but like Oh no that red thing's a little bit it's over the other side. Okay, so we're gonna follow around. I'm gonna try can you get up that climb up the rock, Frederick? What are you doing? Oh shit, is that a zombie? Listen, I don't want no trouble, bro. What's happening? That's called lag. As I said, the rendering issue is a bit annoying there. So you've just got to slow down, which will normally fix it. You slow down and give the game a chance to render. It's normally okay. I think this thing is still chasing me though. Which is never any good. Oh! Now we're in the water. Let's go for a nice swim. Unexpectedly. I can't see for shit. Right, we're back out. It's all good. We need to head over in this direction. This is where things are. I, I, I can hear zombies again. I don't want any trouble, guys. I'm just here to borrow some sugar. I'm just here to borrow some tin openers. One of your peers took my other one. Where am I? Oh, there's palisades. What's that noise? That's really disconcerting. I don't like strange noises, especially not in a game that involves zombies and zombies that take your tin openers. It's the worst kind. The worst kind of discrimination. Where is up here? I think I did one time find a rifle in one of these. Apparently, that's not to be today. Wonderful. Well, we know zombies can't climb through windows, so they presumably can't open doors, nor can they climb ladders. That's what we'll, uh, surmise from that information. Let's... Is this some kind of military bunker? Aren't there robots in this place? Or maybe they're not, I don't know. Right, let's just try and find ourselves a tin opener in a backpack, because I'm not letting that go. Hmm, absolutely nothing. Hmm, absolutely nothing. Okay, guys, well, somebody's been here and taken everything. Oh, boots. Can we? Like, there we go. Take the boots. What's this? A ballistic vest. Nice, we'll take that. Take the ballistic vest. And nothing. That's right, now I'm ready for round two. Where you at, Charlie? 
slag though. Look at these. A riot vest. What's, I wonder what's better, a ballistic vest or a riot vest? Or can I, am I wearing both right now? No, I'm not. What does this do? It's a bulletproof vest. So what, it helps me when I fight real people, maybe? I, ooh! An SVD. That's a sniper rifle, I think, isn't it? Don't suppose it's got... I don't know, it might not be a sniper rifle. <coughs> yeah, sniper rifle, there we go. Semi-automatic designated marksman rifle. Chambered with 54mm rounds. Okay. So I need 54mm rounds. I actually need a melee weapon because... Unless I can use the butt of the gun. Nothing on the tables. I can hear gunshots, which I don't think is ever a good thing. Let's search this. We've got, ooh, a cap. Yeah, damn straight. We'll put that on. Equip. What's this? 5.6 millimeter. So I don't think we can use those. I don't think we can use those at all. Let's search the rest of these things, though. Here, nothing. What's in this one? We got an AK 47 magazine. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Yeah, Charlie, you did me a favor, bruh. What's this? Boonie hat. I don't know, man. I don't know. I think that looks better. We'll go for that. Nothing. Got some gloves here that we'll equip. Oh, we're getting kitted out now, aren't we? We've already got some military boots, we don't need more. We've already selected the hat that we want. Is that something on the floor now? Come on. Give me another gun. Give me an AK 47. At least I've got a magazine for that. An MP5 magazine. But that's a magazine, actually. It's not bullets, it's just a mag in it. Damn. Okay, so we've got a whole lot of nothing from here, really. We've got clothes, but that's about it. We've got weapons we can't yet use. There's one more building to check. So let's do this. What we got here? We've got cheeseburger MRE. Oh, we're ready to eat. Oh, that's not bad. Can we, uh, yeah, we can take that. That's about all we can take. Nothing else in here. Anything at all? No? Probably not, but we'll see. What's on the floor here? Whole lot of nothing. What's this? Let's carry on through. Bunkers or something. Hmm. Let's see what's in the lockers. Anything left behind, lads? You know? Pop a brother out? Ooh, dagger. <laughs> now I'm ready. Yeah, that's right, mate. Now I'm ready. Anything on these? No. I really hate WASD. I can't get... I can't just... I just can't get used to it. Probably just a load of wood there. Uh... We could scrounge in the trash like some gypsy, but we're not going to. So. We're going to take a look at this map. There's a city not far from here we could go to. We've now got a knife. And it looks rather large, so there's potentially a police station there we can raid for some more ammo. Get a handgun maybe, something like that. Um, we've got a knife, so we're more than capable of killing... Charlie and his peers. We need a saw. That's what we need. We need a saw. So we can cut down trees. And cut up zombies to make stakes. So. I'm telling you, I'm still hearing these bullets. But I think they're coming from behind me. And I'm not going that way. Because I want to get... Can I cut... Can I cut these with a knife? Oh, wrong, wrong one. Uh, F. Ah, I can. But 
then again, my bushes will give me, uh, I was going to say, but it's not going to cut down trees, is it? But then, all I need is these uh, sticks I don't need. No, I do need to cut down trees, because to make a fire I need logs and not sticks. Okay, yeah, we're still in the same predicament, I think. Um, head over in this direction anyway, carry on over here. <coughs> not too far now to go anyway. Not too far at all. Just along the road, but we're going to keep off the road, because I think you get a lot of zombies on the road. Yeah, this place looks like it's got plenty in it. Plenty that we can look around in. We're gonna look over here. Let it render for a minute. Stop the lag. What have we got? Alright, nothing there. Keep our eyes out for a police station because there's gotta be one in a town this big. Slow it down a little bit. Lag is really frustrating. Right, okay, there we go. Uh, I think I spot the police station. I think. Yeah, I think I do anyway. Just behind here. If God allows it. Right, okay. I think this is it now, straight ahead. What's that weird blue glow? That might not be the police station. There's a sign on it. I thought it was a police station. That's not even a sign, is it? It's water damage or something. Idiot. Great, okay, so... That's actually nothing. Oh, no, it is a sign. See, it's a pharmacy. There you go. Like I was saying before, so we might get some vitamins from here or something. Um, potentially. Whoa! If there's one thing that's going to make me lose my shit, it's the lag. So where are we over by the sheds? It just seems to struggle when it's got all this rendering to do with the buildings. Okay. Let's search the counter. Nothing. Nothing. So I'm just going to look around, try and... What is that? I can't have that guy. Search. See if we can't pick up some of these vitamins. Something tells me there's not going to be vitamins on the floor. What is that? There they are. Is that aspirins or something? Anti-malaria pills? Who the hell around here has got malaria? Probably that fucking Charlie, man. That's probably where my wife got it from. That bastard. What's in here? Scissors. We don't want scissors. No thank you, no, no to scissors. Say no to sharp objects, kids. Stay in school. Of all the things, <coughs> anti-malaria pills. Damn. This town had more problems than just zombies. That's for sure. There's gloves down there. What type? Driving gloves. Eh, we've already got the military gloves, we don't want them. Anything just a quick and uh, we can pick up? Nope. We'll just have to make do with the anti-malaria pills. We'll pop a few if we get worried. If we get nervous, you know. At least that's one thing that can't harm us now. Beaten malaria since 2K18. Right. Is this just me? Man, I play all sorts on this computer and I never have issues like this. There's a damned police station. I know there is one. Is that it? That's gotta be it. Come on, surely. That's gotta be it. Let's hop over this fence. Yeah.
I find it interesting that there appears to be no zombies in this town. Polisija. Was that Polish or something? What the? Last I checked, I wanted to walk through the door. So. Coffee machine. Nothing in it. Tables. Upturned. It seems only right to do some investigative work when we're in a police station. Now, kids, can anyone tell me what went on here? What have we got here? Diary. The hell would I need a diary for? Day one of the apocalypse. Charlie took my tin opener. Suspected he was fucking my wife. Found anti-malaria pills. What's this on the top of here? Our oh, baseball cap. We don't. We don't want that. We've got one on already. So we're finding like literally nothing right now. Oh, you know it. Yes. Yes. MP5. I don't want the baton. I've got a knife, and we've got an MP5 mag, haven't we? I'm sure we do. Yeah. Can we put these together? Can't we? Take in hand. Why would I need to take it in hand? Can't we just... I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here. Am I supposed to fill up the mag and then put it in the gun? Or am I supposed to... Hmm. Okay, let's just... Figure out that for a second. We'll figure that out. We need to find bullets for this mag. Surprised there's no soap in here. We all know prisoners like to drop the soap. I think the police at least give them soap. Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. Let's carry on. Oh, the jokes! Trollololol. Why is that thing on the back of my head going red? Wasn't that green before? Nothing. Ooh! An M9. I don't think I can pick that up, can I? She's not got the room for anything. Hands. What is this? Can we eat this? Let's eat this. It's probably not going to do anything, but we'll eat it anyway. We haven't eaten for a while. Now, can this go here? No. Damn. Where can this go? Mm. Right, we're going to hang around in this town. We're going to come back and loot all of this. But what we're going to do first is try and find ourselves a backpack, actually. I did have a fanny pack. <laughs> I'm sure I did. Until that Charlie killed me. Is that one in there? I think that's a backpack in there. Me and you. Here we go. Lovely. We've got a backpack. Speak of the devil. And where was that? M5, uh, tech? Techo one? There it is. So. These are 5.6 millimeters, and this needs... It doesn't even tell me what this needs. How do I put bullets in this, then? Is this possible to put bullets in here? I don't think it is. Maybe they're just the wrong bullets. That's perfectly possible. They don't go in there, do they? And they don't go in there. And they don't go in there. They maybe go in there. Like, what bullets are these for, man? I'm really confused as to what I need right now. Did I find anything in there? Gloves. I'm just gonna search these individually and see. More gloves. Why do you need one glove per locker? Come on, boys. Cut it out. So we didn't properly search all of these cells. We're going to now. We've got a backpack out of one, which is obviously very useful. Anything here? No, it doesn't seem so. So... If you can hear a cat in the background, that's because my, uh... 
my cat's going crazy. What is this? Another bulletproof vest. I've already got one on there, but this one's blue. We'll equip the blue one. Because we like blue more than we like camo. What's in here? Nothing. Nothing in there. Like, just more gloves. Like, how many lockers and how many gloves do you need? Of all the things to be kept in a police station, it's the gloves that you just find the most of. Let there be something useful on the roof. No. You have to keep your eyes open because a lot of the useful stuff that you find is actually just loose on the floor. And it's very easy to miss. So we're just going to look around here. Scope it out. What is this? A cap again? Yeah. Well, what's that? Nothing. Just a shit stain. Um. Yeah, there's nothing even of use to anybody in here. Alright then. Let's climb down. There's that noise again. There's that little robot that airlifts little arse eaters into the town. Watch now. Zombies will show up. Look at it. Fuck out of here! What are you doing? I'm trying to loot a police station, mate. Where is it? What is that? What is that? What is that? Can I? What? What even is that? Why does it follow you? Why does it keep a light on me? Keeping tabs on me. God damn it. Right, um, I think what we're going to do, what's this, car battery cables, huh, they'll be useful for when we actually get a car, maybe I should take them, because they're going to be introducing them, I think, they? if they haven't already, I don't think they have, I, what I really want is bullets, I want bullets to, I don't think car battery cables are working on this piece of junk. Uh, what's behind door number four? Find out on the next episode of Charlie Fooped My Waifu. And saw my tin opener. Never forget, guys. Candle. I don't want a candle. God. What this town has is gloves and candles. What the hell were they doing? when the apocalypse struck. But the police can't match fingerprints to anyone in a town with this many gloves. Right, I think we're gonna log out in here guys and call it quits for this episode because... Ooh, hang on, just before we do... Cauliflower! Always eat your greens, kids. Ah, we got some food probably bad, but bad cauliflower is better than no cauliflower. What else is in here? Any bullets? I mean, incidentally, just kind of casually asking. Where is that barbed wire again? We could probably take that now, because, but, um, let's just briefly take a look at our metabolism. Here we go. So we're 0% of targets again, which is really bad. The bladder volume's quite high. We may need to relieve ourselves. Uh, I mean, not doing too great, really. Not doing too great at all. Let's use this bathroom, then. Let's use the bathroom. Oof. Could use, could use a clean, really. This is exactly why you need anti-malaria tablets. So, uh, to get this dial up, by the way, for anybody who may not know. If you click tab it opens up your inventory like this you crafted metabolism and stuff if you hold the tab button it brings up this it took me a while to figure that out so we're gonna take a we're gonna take a piss as it's actually called in the game there we go and then we're gonna pop an anti-malaria tablet afterwards because this place is fucking infested what's that on the floor of the shower i don't know but we will check that out and then we're gonna take a crap we're not actually gonna crap in the toilet because I think it's seen enough of that. Oh, yeah, we're going to stick our head down it instead. That's right. We're going to get right in nice and close. 
I'm gonna make grunting noises. Lovely. The fuck, it just flashed under me. A golden gun! Did I just shit out a gold gun? What the f- What? I just shat out a golden gun. James Bond, eat, eat your heart out. What the f- What's that? Emergency bandage in the shower. I wanna know what one on it. Huh? I can search this. There is too much going on right now for my brain to process. I got a... What's this? I got a, de a gold deagle. The Desert Eagle 50 is a semi-automatic handgun notable for chambering the largest centerfire cartridge of any magazine-fed self-loading pistol. This special golden version marks the one million... the one millionth kill and scum. Okay. What bullets does it take? Add to quick access. Can I not? Is there a way? Seriously, can I just have, like, some bullets that can be used for anything? Let's eat these cauliflowers before we go. Let's see what this does for our metabolism. Should give us some nice vitamins, this. Oh, shit. Well, apparently, bad cauliflower actually isn't better than no cauliflower. Because that was not good at all. The hell just happened? I think my guy was like, yep. Please don't go into random houses, pick up cauliflowers that you have no idea whence they came from, and then eat them. Okay, guys. We're going to call it for this episode. We're going we're gonna to log it out. Nice and safe in the house that we have pissed, shat, and vomited in. Motherfucking world in my palm